Thank you, Tony. The snow falling earlier made for some slick spots on the road. And tonight, drivers being urged to take it slow as temperatures continue to drop. Eyewitness News reporter Sheena Loschuto is keeping an eye on the roads, and she joins us now from live inside Breaking News 1. Sheena? Well, Mike Shannon, we've been seeing a lot of plows out. I want to show you the roads here in Burrowville. They're clear for the most part right now. We've been seeing a lot of plows come through and put down salt on the roads as well. And we have been checking the conditions all over the state for the last few hours. Drivers say the worst part of this all was the low visibility. Snow squalls hit our area at the peak of rush hour Wednesday. Eyewitness news cameras bringing you to Providence. We captured businesses getting ahead of the frigid temperatures clearing the sidewalks. As the weather moved through New England, plows were out all over. Here's a look at the snow in Seekonk. Many of our viewers told us it looked like the flakes were falling down sideways on their drive home. Burrowville was one of the hardest hit areas. Here we found an untouched parking lot. You can tell just how much snow stuck to the ground. As we drove around in Breaking News 1, we also found most of the main roads getting salted. It did fall very quickly. Good news for people who rely on driving for work. Very low visibility. It's bad driving earlier. Like Zachary, who delivers pizzas, he says at some points it was hard to see what's in front of him, so he played it safe. I wasn't able to make a lot of deliveries, but hopefully I can now. Can now. And giving you another live look of the roads here in Burrowville, as you can tell, most of it is clear. There's a lot of white on the sidewalks and on the side, so plows have been moving through. Been seeing a lot of people out there, and also some people shoveling as well to make sure to get their driveways clear before things do freeze over. We will keep monitoring the roads for you and have the latest information on our website, WPRI.com. For now, reporting live with Breaking News 1, I'm Sheena Loshudo, Eyewitness News.